Emily, why do you have an advent calendar? Well, I just, I was looking for something to help me count down the days till Easter. And, well, this is all I had. So, you know, just gotta make do. So you're using the days of December to count down to Easter, which is in April. Right. Well, I mean, at least it gets me halfway there. So Lent is 40 days, but that number is actually significant in scripture. It represents a time of penance. There's Jonah and the people of Nineveh who repented for 40 days. There's Moses who prayed and fasted for 40 days. There's Elijah who repented and prayed for 40 days. There's Ezekiel who lied on his side for 40 days. There's Moses and the Hebrew people who walked the desert for 40 years. And of course, there's Jesus who, after his baptism, prayed and fasted for 40 days in the desert. So, okay, I mean Jonah and Elijah and Jesus were able to pray and fast for 40 days, but that seems really hard. I mean, can anyone really do that for 40 days consistently? The fact is that we Catholics have it pretty easy. easy. I mean, you, you give up, what, beer or chocolate or pizza for 40 days? Yeah, okay, you're right. I mean, we don't really have it that bad. In that moment when I'm struggling or I find it really hard, then, then I need to remember that I need to fill that space with God. So there's 46 days minus six Sundays, which brings us to 40 days of Lent. And the reason why we don't count those six Sundays is because, well, we're not supposed to fast on Sundays because it's a day where we celebrate the Lord's resurrection. So that's why Lent is so long. And if you want to use the calendar, just make sure it has 40 days.